Good morning, everybody. It is the Savage Stacker. So, I know it's been a little while, but I've been working a crap ton of hours, and um, I need to be able to get to the post office to send out some other packages I need to get out. I need to... I did get by there yesterday and check my P.O. box, but it was late, and the only part that was open was the P.O. box side, not the uh, post office side. And I need to buy some supplies to get out a couple other um, packages. So if you're waiting for a, pa for a package from me, I apologize. I will get it out by this weekend for sure. And uh, I'll get that out, whoever the winner is for this as well, this weekend. Um, what's holding me up is I don't, I don't have any packaging. I don't have any like bubble envelopes or anything. So I'll get those out. All right, so let's get this gaw out of the way real quick. This was the pound gaw just for uh, going and checking out a couple really good channels that I enjoy. Uh, Heather, um, love and adore Heather. She's amazing and, um, and uh, she, she kicks ass. So uh, thanks for going and checking out her. Um, then we got Poor Man's Gold. Poor Man's Gold is a straight up savage and a really good dude. And Rick G Profit Coins. Great guy, straight hustler, does his thing. I stopped by there yesterday, was able to go check him out for a little while but while I was working. Um, just kind of, I could just, you know, listen because I was uh, driving, but, you know, trying to keep it safe, trying to keep it safe. All right, let's get this out of the way. So I have, I've taken the uh, time to go and take the link already so i just gotta like double tap it in here paste filter out duplicates um i guess you gotta do this which is nine i'm gonna answer that Wait, why is it not yeah i got it certainly oh i gotta do another one okay And another one, okay. What? Why is it doing this? All right, that doesn't make sense, okay. Added, included, okay, filter comments based on specific text. Okay. I don't know why it's doing that pound. Gah. All right. Um, okay, I think, I don't know why it does this, but it makes me like, um, okay, that, do this. Math equation here, boom. Okay, amount of comments is 25. 25, that doesn't sound right, but okay. So I guess 25 of you, I feel like that's not right at all. Hold on, let me go, let me make sure I got the right link. Because there was a lot of views and a lot of people put that in there. Okay, go to my channel, go to the video. Um, hey, what's the biggest mistake guys make when it comes to cooking and grilling? You gotta it's love the, the commercials things. in the middle of my video here. All right, I can't. All right, let's see here. I'll go to this, we'll go to no. What is going on here? Okay, wait. Go like this. Go to share. Copy link. Come back out of here. Go to here. Go to this. Take all this out of here. Bear with me, I might just have to start this over since I haven't actually pushed any names yet. Um, let's see if I get this right. Paste. 
Uh, all right, I think we're set up here. All right. Go like this. 13, and go like that. Yeah, it says 25 of you. 25 of you. All right, well, let's get to it then. I feel like that's not right, but okay. So I got filter out duplicates. I got filter comments based on specific text. Um, and then pound, gah. And I feel like there's a lot more of you than 25. Just doesn't seem right, but okay, that's what it says. Anyways, here we go. Good luck to everybody. Elton Jones, my buddy Elton Jones, congratulations. Comment, pound God. <laughs> That's what he put on there. <laughs> All right, get in there, brother. All right, Elton Jones, give me an email, shoot me an email, and, um, and uh, you know, and I'll get that package out to you probably this weekend because uh, we're ramping up our, our, um, we're ramping up our stuff uh, for the week. Uh, I'm trying to get this job done at a certain phase of the job. So I've been working 12 hour days, two hour commute, 14 hour days. So it's been long. It's been, a, it's been a long week. So, um, I will probably get this and another one, another, uh, package out for Aaron. I'll get him, uh, get those packages out this weekend. That's what I'll do. So give me an email, shoot me an email and, uh, I'll get that out to you, brother. All right. Mr. Elton Jones, right there. Let me write that down so I don't forget. Maybe, maybe not. Okay, I don't know where our pen's at. This is moving right along here. Elton Jones, this is what you want, brother, right here. All right, look at that. I believe this is the best coin around that has came out in probably... I don't know. Well, the new Black Flag series just came out, and they'll be here tomorrow. Um, really stoked on those. I'm probably going to flip almost all of them, um, but really stoked that those, that came out. I've been waiting for that for like a year. And um, But besides that, new Black Flag ship coin coming out. This right here is probably the best coin that's came out in the last four to five years. That's just my opinion. This thing is amazing. And then the colored ones, the two ounce ones, they're awesome as well. So Alton Jones, this is what you got right here, brother. All right. So shoot me an email. Okay, here we go. I have a couple other things here I need to talk about. Oh, let's talk about this. Boom. Oh, 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 oh. oh look at that thing. Magnum Tonto 12. Cold steel. And it's made out of sand mai. You can see the line right there because it's layered, layered steel. It's cold steel. Taiwan. This is old stock stuff, not the new stock. This is old stock and uh, good stuff. I got it because I got this little sucker right here. This little pig sticker. The Croto, the Kyoto. And um, yeah, see this one right here? They sold the company, which is now in China. So uh, I got that because I like this this kind of stuff. And um, But I wanted this. This is a much more expensive knife, sword, whatever you want to call it. And then for my buddy, I wanted to show him real quick. Mountaineer stacker. Look at this thing. Old school LMF. Light military fixed blade knife. This is an old Gerber. They are serialized. And uh, quarter inch blade steel stock on these things. Quarter inch, look how thick that is, that spine. These things are not cheap. And uh, a buddy of mine gave this to me years ago. Just gave it to me, he knows I love knives. And uh, just to be able to get the sheath, 
it costs like 200 bucks for this thing. If it goes on your Molly, and this is what goes on my loadout, is uh, that goes on my loadout right there. And uh, yeah, Gerber USA. Gerber used to be a very, very good knife making company made really well-made knives, and now they kind of are garbage. Actually, they're coming back. They're starting to do really well again. Um, but, you know, from the 90s, the late 90s to about two or three years ago, they kind of turned to garbage. Um, they do have some nice uh, um, switch blades, though, or automatics. All right, here we go. Real quick here. We got something from Patriotic Stacker, and um, I already took the liberty of uh, cutting it open, but I have not checked inside yet. Here we go, we got a sticker right here, Patriotic Stacker. And right here, boom, look at this. Does that come off? It does come off. Oh no. I hate tape. I just like to smash through shit and uh, To rip all the birds off of here. Okay, there we go. Okay, Patriotics Patriot Coin Gaw entry 825. My bro, Savage, stay updated for awesome giveaway. Okay, I guess so. This is what happened. So, what he's doing is he's doing a uh, a uh, this is, if you got one of these coins in the mail and he gave you one, that means you're automatically entered for this giveaway, which is completely awesome dude uh i like that um a lot of times we get mm, people that come by just for giveaways and you know what it, that's fine as long as they're watching the content and i know we can't always get the people's channels and watch their stuff every day there's so many people i'd like to support and i always show up going hey brother it's been a long time since i've been by i just wanted to say hi and it might have been three or four or five months and people do it to me too which is fine that's totally fine i get it we get busy lives but then you got people that come by only for giveaways. You never see them any other time for the, but that, you know, and which is cool. I mean, it, it's not, we don't exclude those people, but sometimes it gets old, I guess you could say, you know. So uh, what he's doing here is he's doing a giveaway to, um, you know, to the people that he sent these out to, which is awesome. I I think I'm going to do the same. I think I, I got something that I want to do that with. Uh, just for the community um, So uh, I'm gonna do that probably it's a great idea. I'll probably do that after he does this I don't like stepping on people's toes and all that stuff. So 1916 barber dime mintage 18 million four hundred ninety thousand come on brother send me the send me the 16 D uh, <laughs> To the 16 send me the 16 D uh, uh, mercury <laughs> But yeah, right there. So I am entered in the giveaway. So thank you, Patriotic. Appreciate it, brother. I'll get some stickers out to you this weekend. You asked me for more stickers. And uh, that's that. Okay. 13 minutes and 33 seconds into this video. Well, 39 now. Um, we're going to talk about some shit. Okay. We have a lot going on. We got uh, the crazy lady mrs pelosi going to uh, taiwan no matter what which is hey we showed strength and uh you know middle finger to china right but um where is that going to put us geopolitically and what's that going to do for metals if things ramp up well it's just going to add to all the drama that's already going on and i'm sure where the markets are going to um be affected by it in some way, shape, or form. So, um, with that said, let's buy some metals. Let's do some shopping with the Savage. All right. So, oh, that's the wrong iPad. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Let's go down here. Let's go like this. I'm so not used to the iPad. Let's go Monument Metals. Let's go to Monument Metals. Boom, they just got these one ounce Sunshine Mint bars back in stock. Look at that, 425 over spot. That is crazy for generic silver. 
that's what we're looking for right there, shop. I said shop. All right, there we go. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pick up two of those. JBR, right, JBR, yeah, JBR kilo bars. I'm gonna add those suckers to the cart. We're gonna continue shopping because if I don't spend 1500, um, if I don't spend 1500, I'm not gonna pay taxes. That would be like $140 in taxes right there. If you spend $1499, you're spending $1500 or $150 in taxes. But if I go one more dollar and I go 1500, it saves me 150 bucks. So I think what I'm gonna do to get to that is, let's see here. Um, Where's that? I don't see the squiggly lines. It's different on here for the iPad. Let's just go to silver. American Silver Eagles, no. Um, 90% right there. Let's go to 90%. Let's go down to uh, Roosevelt Dimes. And let's add quantity one, add to cart. View shopping cart. 1534.71. Not bad for two kilos and a tube of dimes. Not bad at all. Um, compared to what I was paying, uh, it would have been two grand if we, you know, we bought this six months ago. I would have been nine, it would have been like 1800 bucks just for two kilos. So not bad at all. So I think that's what I'm going to do right there. And, um, yeah, what are you guys purchasing right now? Let me know down in the comments. Um, we're going to go ahead and do that right there, but I'm not going to put my card information in there, obviously, while I'm on camera. But uh, that's what I'm going to do right there. I've had this in the cart four or five times over the last two days, and uh, just haven't pulled the trigger yet, but that's probably going to be the next purchase. The only reason why I haven't pulled the trigger is because I'm, bidding on a bar on ebay and that's probably going to be another five six hundred dollars on top of this and i don't know if i want to spend twenty one hundred dollars right now on metals because i'm trying to save some money to buy a monster box and uh but with all the things going on geopolitical and uh you know inflation, housing market, food, fuel, all these different things going on, you know, um, I feel like it's better to get it a little early than it is to get it a little late. Is it FOMO? Who knows? I'm highly addicted to buying metals and there could be very worse addictions out there. So that is what I'm going to do. I'm going to buy some more metals. Thank you all for coming by. It is a Savage Stacker. Thanks to Elton Jones. Thank you to everybody that um, that was a uh, part of this giveaway. I appreciate you. Thanks for going by and checking out those channels. I appreciate you. And um, thank you to the channels that I did the giveaway for. You guys are awesome. And uh, thank you, Patriotic Stacker, for entering me in your gaw. All right. Leave me know in the, let me know in the comments what you're buying right now. Um, what is your your trip? Are you buying vintage, generic? Are you buying uh, constitutional? Are you buying gold? Um, I've been mostly buying gold, except for all those bars I bought, those Nader bars. And uh, but you know, we're at eighty five and ninety to one on the silver. I I think I'm be I'm gonna buy a little more silver, and um, and I'm gonna try the silver bean counter um, way of stacking. I think I'm gonna try doing. The, uh, you know, the, uh, uh, the GSR, right? The gold to silver ratio way of stacking to see if that works. Um, I'll try it one or two times and, uh, and see if I like it. And um, buy gold when the GSR is lower and buy silver when it's higher. So we'll see what happens with that. I'm still trying to cost average out my stack. It's, uh, you know, it's been a... Uh, it's been a blessing that it has come down this far. It's gone back up a couple bucks, but it's been a blessing. 
Thank you, everybody, for coming by. It is a Savage Stacker. Let me know what you're stacking down in the comments. Gold, silver, constitutional, generic, eagles. I doubt it. Don't buy no eagles. Um, but, yeah, let me know down in the comments. Thank you all for coming by. Thanks to L. Jones. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. The Savage Stacker is over and out.